How many of you are in the Casio watches? I really love mine. What is going on YouTube? How are you guys doing today? We have uh, a few things to go over, so let's check it out. We are going to go over my favorite river fishing pairing here, and probably just all together, my favorite jig pairing in all of time. What we have here is a finesse jig, a ball head finesse jig from Six Sense Fishing that is going to weigh five eighths of an ounce. I think this is the, the brownie color. It's just brown, only brown. There's nothing nothing crazy. The, the brush guard is brown, the skirt is brown, and the, uh, the actual weight is brown too. Sorry, the hook is not brown. That's gonna be black nickel coated. Super duper sharp. And that jig comes with a screw lock so you can stop losing a bunch of soft plastics to those fun fish we all chase after. And then I like to pair that up with a stroker craw. So we have a, I think this is gill dust. The gill dust color is very brown. It's got a bunch of fleck in there. It's super colorful too. And then what we'll do always, disconnect those tails. And because it's a finesse jig, I personally like to just see if I can do it. Rip this this half off about that much. Then you're gonna take these two and you're gonna rig it up and catch fish on it. I'm, I'm gonna rig it up and then talk a little bit more about it. All right, there's that lovely, supernatural, compact combo there. Ballhead finesse jig and stroke call. What I like to do in the river is just quarter downstream or quarter upstream. And then I'm gonna just let this slowly drift with the current and hopefully ticking a bunch of rocks on the way through and just slowly reeling this in around any structure I possibly can find or any uh, deeper pools with some fast moving water either on top or on the bottom of it, that pool and then usually those fish are held up there. They'll see something like this. They'll be like, that's a great meal. Especially there's a bunch of crawfish in my river and they feed up on those quite a bit. So this is a perfect presentation to those smallmouth, and uh, they just chew it up. I go through a lot of finesse jigs and a lot of stroker crawls because I'm either losing them to the river or I'm losing them to uh, the fish break in line. But that ball head is kind of nice for in the river. Um, the, the snags are far and few. So, yeah, if you're looking for a great river fishing combination, uh, you should really just check this one out. All right, everybody, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope you liked the little tips and tricks slash bait breakdown videos. Anyway, if you liked it, hit that like button. Hit that subscribe button. Tell me what you liked and what you didn't like in the comments. And then, as always, fish till you drop.